Welcome back to Mini Shorts and today we are talking about the rear valance panel. This one needs to come off because, well, it's terrible all the way along. I also think it's not a particularly good fit where it's been lined up with the holes, especially here. So that was quite tricky to get the bumper off because this hole's not quite the right size. And also, there's lots of work that needs doing underneath, under there, and these need changing, and these reinforcement panels need changing. So, what tools are we using? We're using the hammer with a centre punch to punch where this has been plug welded on. Then we're using the little drill bit just to give us even more of a center and then we are using the drill that doesn't run out of battery with a proper cutting spot weld drill so this bit in the middle is sprung and then this bit cuts around the plug weld rather than using a flat spot weld drill bit because a flat spot weld drill bit that we used before on the sills I'm not sure how well it would get on with these big plug welds so we're just going to use this one so I'll try and just film cutting one more out for you here's one I've already started so gotta go pretty quickly you can see in there it's starting to cut through probably a bit of an annoying noise for you so I'll just show you up here where I finished cutting through and the way to know that you've finished cutting through is well on this car anyway you start getting rusty brown coming from what would have been the boot floor there should be three pieces here this is the back panel lip then we've got the boot floor which is this rusty one in the middle and then we've got the new valance old new valance panel which isn't so rusty so when we're cutting through you start getting the brown dust you know that we're getting into the boot floor right that's it I've just got to drill out all of these so that's gonna take a while thanks guys bye